Today we're going to make cinnamon sugar breadsticks and it's a very easy recipe. I kind of just wing it. I put some flour, some milk, and until the dough looks like it's a decent consistency and then uh, deep fry it. Uh, put cinnamon sugar and salt on it. So a very easy recipe. There's probably better methods of doing it than what I'm going to have. Um, but this is something that took me less than 10 minutes. Kind of impresses the wife when it was Mother's Day. And it's been like a nice little treat this morning. So I have one cup of flour and I'm going to add a quarter cup of milk. And I'm going to turn this on. That looks like it needs more milk. So I think I'm going to add, let's add another quarter cup. And that looks workable. It's time to roll them out. So now I'm going to flour everything. That means cutting board and my hands because I think this is a little bit wet, probably added too much milk, but the point I'm trying to make today is just how easy it is to work with flour. It might not be exactly what you expect, but when we put sugar and cinnamon on things, it's not gonna matter that much. So I'm gonna kinda just cover this in flour so it's less sticky for my hands. And you know, we can add some more flour. So you could do two things if you need it, like this, um, the dough is going to become um, tighter, like it's going to want to go back into its original shape. So I'm not going to need it too much, unless I'm going to take some time to rest it. I'm not going to do that because we just want to have these cinnamon sugar things right now. So now I'm going to roll this out. I'm going to say thinner is better. And we'll do some sort of twist thing. Alright, we'll save these. I would say if you're going for something more professional, make it them thinner. But I think I'm just hungry and I'm ready to eat. So next I started a pan on, I'm gonna say medium to high heat. But really you were just trying to heat up the oil. As far as how much oil I added, now if you watch any professional cook, they are gonna load their pan up with tons of oil. Um, I like to, I guess, save money, so I'm just going to do each side one at a time. It's not going to taste exactly like a donut, but cinnamon, sugar, and salt is going to taste good regardless. So why spend extra on more oil that you're just going to end up dumping in the compost? So, all right, I think this is almost ready. You can do that test thing where you toss water onto it, um, but I know that this is pretty hot, so we're going to add... These look pretty much done. If I just rotate it one more time, make sure all the sides are nice and hot. And turn off the heat. And we'll put this in the cinnamon sugar mix. Okay, so note to self, 
in the future, make sure you have the cinnamon sugar ready because you want to put the cinnamon sugar on the bread sticks as soon as they get hot. Because right now they're still cooking. So yeah, just some cinnamon, doesn't have to be a lot. And then we're just going to put a little bit of salt as well. Don't go too crazy with the salt. Maybe we will go crazy with the salt. Okay, we're ready. I'm going to mix it up and the throw sticks on. <laughs> 